Hello viewers, welcome to Home Cooking. I am Kalpana. Today I am going to show you quinoa with the chicken. Now let me show you the ingredients first. This is the quinoa. I took one cup of the quinoa and then I washed it nicely for two to three times. Okay, we need chicken. I cut them into small pieces like this. And then uh, onions, garlic, ginger. If you have uh, chicken stock, you can use that. I don't have the chicken stock. That's why I'm using the stock cube. So that's there. Uh, coriander. This is tomato paste. This is slightly stronger. So I'm using one to one and a half tablespoon of that. Chili powder, garam masala powder, two cups of water, oil. My pan is hot now. I'm adding in two to three tablespoon of oil. If you want, you can add some butter also. Once it's hot, I'm going to add in the onions. Quinoa is very highly nutritious. It's gluten free, high source of uh, protein. It has got lots of uh, health benefits. So actually good to include it in our diet it's gluten free so people who are allergic to gluten they can use this now I'm adding in the garlic and ginger if you have ginger garlic paste together also you can use that so just add them and saute I'm adding in the chicken saute them nicely Now the chicken has coated nicely with the oil, so it's slightly brown now. At this stage, I'm just going to add in the chili powder, followed by the tomato paste, then garlic. This tomato paste gives a good color to the dish also. You can also use chicken thigh pieces, you know, boneless uh, chicken thigh pieces. They will taste even better. Today I am using chicken fillet. So cut them like this, small pieces. Now I am adding in the chicken stock. Chicken just mix it well, once it mixes it well, you can add in the quinoa. Okay, nicely. For 2 to 3 minutes. sauteed it for roughly three minutes now I'm adding in the water this cooks like rice also like for one cup of quinoa we are adding two cups of water so same ratio so let it boil adding in some salt because even the stock you work has got some uh, salt so be careful when you're adding the salt I'm adding in some curry uh, masala powder Now it starts to boil, so just give it a mix and then reduce the flame and cover and cook it until it's completely done. Now it's starting to boil, so cover it and reduce the flame to medium and let it cook. After 20 minutes they look like this. Just garnish it with some coriander leaves or some parsley, whatever you have. And our quinoa with chicken is ready. So do try this at home and post your comments. Thank you so much for watching.